sponsored by Kia, the Kia Slam Cam, giving us a great look at that one. And Dallas calls their first time. Buck is right now. I wonder if this is the early stages of a blowout. Well, we've got to be careful, don't we? Try to make it a three-point play. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. Purposeful passing it is, partner. Their last ten points have all come off assists. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And examining his numbers this season, we can see that he's been an exceptional free throw shooter. Right around 85. Got Shoot one more at the free throw line. Moving it around. Eight of their last ten coming off assists. And Greg, you know nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. Suns have made their only other free throw attempt today in an earlier trip to the line. Everything they've put up this month. The Suns in second. Yeah, Kevin, it's been a long month. Check out how Phoenix stacked up. First in assist, second in steal. See which one of them is playing the stingiest defense over the span of the last 10 games. I mean, just a heartbreaking way to lose the game. Yeah, and when you think about it, Greg, there was some really sloppy basketball being played by them at that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Suns have gone three for three at the line tonight. And they've had really good numbers all season from the free throw line. And guys, that's a pretty good improvement over last season. And the first one at the line is good. And the Mavericks making a change here. Both free throw. The West and how the teams are stacking up. Taking a look at Phoenix. Advantage in one series. It could be a three-point play. Strong work for him at the offensive end, helping them to maintain that lead. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Shooting one. And that one on the wrong side of a big run. And the teams are going to have to wait before heading to the locker room. They're going to bring out the monitor and see if he got that shot off in time. And the NBA replay center in Secaucus is queuing it up. And even before we look at the replay, I'm pretty sure he got that off in time. Yeah, and that's how it looked to me. And that's the call we should see here. But no harm in going back to the footage and making absolutely certain. Good. And they've taken a look at it, and they've overturned the call. They've overturned the call. Uh, they're calling the basket good, Greg. Yeah, and that's why we have replay. I mean, to make sure the officials don't miss any calls. And really, a good job to take the second look at it. Would have been a shame if they'd been cheated out of those points. And through the first half, a pretty lopsided affair. Phoenix ahead, delivering the blowout. And we'll get going after this from the American Airlines Center. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Well, two quarters down, two to go. Welcome back. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, and Kenny and Jim Smith as we start breaking it down for you. Things were going Phoenix's way from the beginning. They opened up the game knocking down shots and defending extremely well, going on a blazing 15-2 run. From their first bucket of the game to the end of the first quarter, they held on to that lead with an iron fist, never once giving it up. Then in quarter number two, it was all hands on deck, and what a show it was. Quality execution, good efficiency, some tremendous defensive play, helped them take a decisive advantage, and they're running away with this Kenny, let's start with you. What did you think about the Suns? Well, they just about ran their offense to perfection. They pounded the ball inside, and the entry fees were on time and on the money. It was a clinic to watch. The second half is going to be no contest if they keep getting shots eight feet net. And looking at Dallas, Shaq, your thoughts? Well, they were playing like it was Christmas. Right? Giving up a lot of turnovers. There's no excuses for the turnover numbers, sloppy ball handling. 
They looked out of control, and the execution was all over the place. All right, that is going to wrap up our halftime report, as it's just about time for the start of the third quarter. It's been lights out this month. The Suns fifth. I, I just love them and scoring with confidence. tonight, five of six. I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen throughout. Just simply being outplayed both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into quick points. And that can't continue. I mean, if they hope to get back in this game, I mean, it's really deflating from a morale standpoint. They need stops and points, not turnovers. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Yeah, on the free throw. That's his second personal foul. Third team foul. The Suns are gone six of eight from the free throw line tonight. The first one falls. Dallas making a switch here. Two that time. And it's coming easy for them right now. Five baskets in a row in the bank. And I say, hey, if it keeps working, go to it. Stay with it. I mean, until the defense responds and provides more resistance, keep making them pay. He makes it. So it's the Suns winning easily here. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. That's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for tuning in. Now time to send you over to the award-winning Ernie Johnson for the postgame show with Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. The 2K Sports postgame show. Kevin, much appreciated, and now let's move on to our Jordan player of the game. An absolutely astounding and historic night for him here in this game. He was simply unstoppable in what can only be described as a masterful performance. And how'd you feel about his performance, Jack? His accuracy from the field was pretty eye-catching. I mean, if he was shooting the ball, it was gone. You really see a performance like this. It's crazy how I shoot this thing. Wow. He was an artist with the basketball tonight, guys. Just a ridiculous amount of assists for him in this game. The way he moved the ball around the court, making sure everyone had their hand in the offense, was superb. That's how you play the point in this league, ladies and gentlemen. And that brings us to the end of our broadcast for this evening. For Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, Kevin Harlan, and our illustrious 2K Sports group, this is Ernie Johnson saying good night, and we'll see you again soon but not soon enough.